anybody hear me? Five more minutes, Mom, please. We've been paged by Division Alpha. Uh, in the middle of the night, oh, man. Yes, fortunately. There's a jet waiting for you. You'll receive further instructions once you're in the air. Not even a quick hello first, Alpha Prime? Hello, Agent Miner. Well, you won't be needing me. You can just drop me off anywhere. I'll call a cab or something. Oh, uh, no, Dr. Newmeyer. You're part of this mission. Yeah, but I... <laughs> Robocop may require assistance in the Sub-Zero weather. Sub-Zero? Where exactly are we going? You're going to Antarctica. We've lost communication with an international scientific colony there. It's cold. Maybe their tongues are stuck to a flagpole. Hey, it happens. It was barely nine, okay? They've been searching for meteor rocks trapped there in the ice. They found something, haven't they? Last report indicate that they unleashed a sort of space virus. You have to quarantine the base camp and isolate the virus. Understood. The virus cannot be allowed to escape to the rest of the planet. Try this. You put your right leg in, you put your right leg out, then you shake it all about. <laughs> Great. Now I'm going to have that song stuck in my head all day. Hey, the camp, we're about to land. Not exactly. I hate this part! are disabled. No one's going anywhere until we say so. Oh, joy. Good. We think the cold may be containing the virus, but if it escapes to warmer climates, 
What can you tell us about this space virus? Not much. It seems to cause the terror. The virus makes people afraid of what? Everything. The hallucinations are their own worst fears coming true. Your computer has an unusual delete key. Our cook has always been scared of computers. Remind me not to annoy your cook. I'd better go check on him in sick bay. Where are you keeping the meteor fragments that caused all this? We've sealed the source of this plague in a special box in a containment tunnel. I will contact Division Alpha for quarantine pickup. They'll dispose of the space rocks, but what about the stuff already in the air? Well, if no more escapes from the space rocks, then what's here could dissipate until it's basically harmless. In theory. If this virus makes it out of here, the whole world would just collapse in fear. <gasps> don't, don't push me! Don't! Dr. Negroni, calm down. <gasps> Do not be afraid. Away from me! The dogs! They're gonna get me! Help! I will attempt to stop her. That's a containment hut! Someone's broken in! Let me be hallucinating, please let me be hallucinating! I'll go check it out. Do not be afraid! The safe suit. I cannot access my equipment. Uh, triple PhD does not count. I can't even cut my own toenails without getting nauseous. I can't swim! I don't know how to swim! Help me! Hey! We got a problem. Someone's stolen the virus. Don't move, citizen. We'll be right back. And now, back to the show. Why would a member of the science team steal the space rocks? It's not like they can go anywhere. It is a long, long way home. There are significant thermal fingerprints. Perhaps Division Alpha will have a match. Alpha communications. I see it too, and it's very, very real. And very much the work of Dr. Anias Gaia. That twisted gene doctor here? Somehow that elderly woman's thermal prints are a perfect match for Gaia. But every member of this colony has a level 5 security clearance. But then, we are talking about Anias Gaia. Ranger. But this woman must be 70 years old, and Gaia can't be more than, say, 39, 
40, maybe 41. Hey, don't be catty. That's my job. You didn't recognize me, did you? <laughs> I can manipulate my cells at a genetic level. Oh, my little <laughs> beauty secret. Return the space stones, Gaia, or there will be trouble. I couldn't hear you over all that exploding! Your chance. It's only temporary. But we've got to get Gaia. I have scanned the area. She has no means of transportation. As you said, where is she going to go? Those bird things. Why did Gaia bother to create them? Dispersion of virus. First, the birds are exposed, then they travel to a warmer climate where it multiplies. In a matter of days, the whole world's exposed. Great, like Typhoid Mary, only these things can fly. Then the whole world collapses from fear. And Gaia has her chance to create a perfect world from the ground up. How long before Division Alpha said the backup team would be here? 14 hours. That's too late. Oh, wait. I can't go in there. I was exposed to the virus. I tested your suit's air during the repair. You were not contaminated. But the seal is only temporary. That's a relief. Thank you. This is a sterile room. Go away. My partner requires attention. We won't let you in. Yes, you will. Tracking down Anaya's Gaia. Dr. Gaia? Here? Where's Miner? Is she okay? Her suit was torn, but she's in a safe place now. Wait! What happened to your suit? You've been exposed! I'm fine, but we have to stop Gaia. Did you just say we? Yes. Maybe I, I could just um, stay here and, uh, you know, make some oatmeal for when you get back. Maybe. My visual scanner is malfunctioning. <laughs> Let me take a look. Robocop, are you okay? We'll be right back. Obey the law. Welcome back, citizens. Do not come closer, or I will fire. R Robo Robocop! You're hallucinating! All weapon systems! Robocop, no! Please be okay, please be okay! the virus you were hallucinating correction i am hallucinating let's get you to sick bay no we have to stop gaia but you can't function like this i am stronger than this i have to focus on my mechanical side but how are you going to track down gaia that's where you come in 
You have to override my systems. You have to take control. Oh, this feels like a bad idea. It's not safe oh, at all. Oh, we don't have any time. Please, you're all Quiet. wrong. I don't know anything about making antidotes, but you do. Here's the deal. You get busy, or I'll introduce you to a whole new meaning of your worst fear. Robo Slammer. I installed seat belts, right? Okay then. I'll do what I can. Let's go get Gaia. Sorry. My fault. Hey, got a bug. Where? To the right, by, by the icebox! It's gotta be Gaia! Here she is. Wait for her! Return the rocks and you will not be harmed! Never! This space virus is my key to a new world order! My world order, Tin Man. Within days, every genetically juvenile human will be destroyed by its own worst fears. Then I'll create my own perfect world the way it was meant to be. <laughs> no. no, get away from me! My flock will share this virus with the world! To the beginning of the end. Stop her! Must trust my mechanical half. Open your shoulder panel. What? Do it! Explosive rocket. See what other tricks I put up your sleeve. What's that? My hallucinations are getting worse. Actually, that's real. Well, that's a relief. Wait, that's not good. My ride's here. Yep. No! Farewell! Stop! Nobody hurts my friend. You call that pile of wires a friend? antidote you came up with is working. Don't thank me. The scientists just needed a little motivation. So your worst fears were about losing your human self? I thought so. Until I thought I was losing my friends. I wonder. Space debris hits the Earth every day. That fear virus could be floating everywhere. In small amounts, I guess it doesn't affect people. Yeah. I'm just glad to be home where it's safe.
down that remote. We'll be right back. And now, back to the show. Get set for the Pokemon Invasion. Next, go around the world, into the sky, and across the sea, because you got to catch them all. It's your favorite creatures like you've never seen them before. Sit back. Pokemon takes America by storm next on the WB11.